Yo, what's up? My name's Jet Leon, and I'm not in the it's best of moods at the moment, now. because apparently Steam does not like me very much, because t today is the final day of their Game of the Day offers for their five free-to-plays they added since Wednesday, and both of the offers that I cared about, for the one for the hat, free TF2 hat in Spiral Knights, and today you get a free gun in AVA if you play it, and neither of them apply to me, because I played both of those games before they were on Steam, so I get nothing. Now, in Spiral Knight's case, that's because they ha didn't add uh, functionality to tie old accounts into new accounts yet. And they're adding that until this week, so that's kind of excusable that I didn't get that because they hadn't added it yet. It wasn't even a feature. I'm still mad that I didn't get the hat, though, because the hat is awesome. But ABA is just blatant cruelty. Because they blatantly said, if you had a former EG account, you don't get the free gun. Now, to put that into perspective, how unfair that is, the gun they give you is the L85A2, a, a rifleman assault rifle, and in the game, it's sergeant rank, or staff sergeant rank 3 and 48,000 euros. You want to know how hard it is to get that in-game? It would literally require 30 hours of gameplay. That's right, gameplay. I mean, in-match gameplay, not just having the game on. You have to be in matches for 30 hours to get enough money to get that. It's to get that and to get the level too. I'm already at that level though, but it's still annoying that you'd have to spend that much time getting the gun. And they're giving it away free, but only to the noobs who didn't never heard of the game before it was out on Steam. Now some people, like I know, like my friends, they never heard of it. Well, most of them actually did hear about it because I was like, get this game. Whenever I found out, I was, like, whenever I found out, I was like, this game is awesome. You need to get this game. But still, now that it's on Steam, a bunch of people just download it because they're like, I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. You get a free gun, yeah. But that's not fair. Because I'm a customer too. I played the game before it was on Steam. But I'm being punished because I'm more hardcore than the rest of them. Because I like the game more than the rest of them. They punish me. They make it so I have to spend an extra 30 hours to get what everyone else is getting free. That's that's messed up. I'm I'm the customer too. I think I deserve the free gun. That's, it's just not fair. And that's no excuse, because they bla it's not like the Spiral Knights one, where they just didn't have the functionality. They have the functionality already in there. As soon as you log in with an EG account all through Steam, that one EG account is linked to your Steam account, and you can only use the EG account with that Steam account. But, you just they just blatantly said, if you had the game before, you get nothing. And that's messed up. It's like, I mean, really, I'm, I just have to, like, I'm, I don't know whose fault it is, EG or Valve, but I still want to go up to whoever thought of that, who's in charge of this event. I want to slap them. It's like, just because I'm smarter than you and had these games before Steam had them doesn't mean you get to punish me. It's like, yes, I'm more hardcore than you. Doesn't that mean I should get the more, uh, I'm more deserving of the reward? Now, I'm not saying that just because I, like, had the game longer I should get it, but it doesn't make sense that you should punish someone who had it before. That, that doesn't make sense to me. It's like you're alienating a fan base. Like, you're kicking out the people who are already there in favor of people who just got there. And that doesn't make any sense, and it just annoys me because, like I said, that gun is awesome. Kept stealing it from a guy in Demolition because it was an awesome gun. It fit with me, and I'm mad I don't get it. I want that gun. It's like it's 48,000 euros, 30 hours of gameplay to get. I want the gun, and they're getting it for free. It's like, and that may just be me because I kind of screwed myself over in the game because you can buy two guns when you start. They give you enough money for that, and I sold one of the ones I had because I did not understand the gambling system and wasted the money off of the thing thinking I was going to get a replacement. I didn't. So, yeah, I screwed myself over. Now the only gun I actually have is the M4A1 I bought. I sold my Bison SMG. I regret that. But now I know I'm, I'm not gambling ever again on that game. I'm not doing it. I don't know. What I need to do though is my birthday's coming up and I'm probably going to get a lot of money because that's all I'm asking for is money because I want to buy a computer and then whatever's left over I can spend on stuff and I'll just get some G coin and uh, like buy the items that give you free euro 
and then buy the, some guns. Because I've got 20,000 drill, and then one of the items gave you 40,000, so I could buy a gun with that. And then, like, participate in the raffle that you could get up to, it. like... I forgot what the highest is, but I know one guy said he got 150,000 euros off of it. It's like, that's a lot of guns. And that's a lot of gun modifications. That's awesome. Man, I love my victory theme, but still. Task at hand. AVA. Gotta talk about it. And it's hard to stay on track. Like, I can't, I can't stay mad at stuff. I had, like, crazy rage when I played this, and then I got my sniping out. And I was just like, okay, I'm bored now. Went covert ops and swam, but still. It's hard for me to stay mad, but I gotta stay I have to stay mad at that. I'm mad at myself because I sold my Beezin, and I'm mad that I don't get the free rifle just because I played the game before the noobs. It's like, now, if you honestly want the game, and you just didn't know about it, well, I don't even know how to say that without getting myself in trouble or removing my point of view. So I'm not happy about the people who never played the game before Steam getting a reward that I don't just just because they got it on Steam. I have it on Steam too, but I also had it before. So I get punished because I have it before? I don't understand that. I don't get the free gun. I played it on there. I spread the word. I don't know what they want out of me, honestly. It's like, but I feel that I earned that gun. And I'm, I wouldn't be raging so much. It's like it's just an item in a game. However, it's an item in a game that requires like MMORPG levels of dedication for you to earn. Cause like it takes, cause to get money in ABA, you only get money after matches during certain events. Like they have one on now, and you get money after matches. But usually it's that you get EXP and supply points, and you get 5,000 uh, euro with your supply points. Or whenever you get the you know, the supply drop with full supply points, but that takes a long time to get full supply points, and the only way to get them faster is get medals and ribbons by completing certain objectives in the game. But that even that is still takes a good while. Only way to earn fast euro is to do the crazy things with medals, because medals can give you the supply points or euro, and the small ones like get a like get a lot of SM weapon kills. SMG kills was the most recent one I had, but get a lot of kills with a weapon and you get supply points and then however like the crazy ones get you Euro like win streak, if you get like I think like a thirty or forty or something win streak and above that you get ten thousand Euro each ten from the win streak. And that's really the only way to get real. I'm just not happy. I wanted the free gun and I wanted the TF2 hat. And they didn't give it to me because I'm more hardcore than everyone else. I had the game before. And I don't like that. Whatever. This is Jet Leo 1 and I'm just... I need to get over my rage. I need to go play something else. I don't know. Bye-bye.